Hi YouTube, this is Marquisha. I am here to share with you guys a couple of projects that I created. Um, I had so much fun creating these projects. Um, so, 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 so super cute. And um, let me get started. So, um, let me just show you the first thing that I created. Oh my gosh, it is so super cute. This is an altered teapot. I picked this up at Michael's and it is one of the terracotta pots. Um, and what I did to this pot was I first um, painted with the Americana light buttermilk um, acrylic paint. And then I let that dry. And then if you can see here, I have Mod Podge all over this teapot here. So cute. And the paper line that I used was the Preppy Princess from the Die Cuts with the View. So this is so, 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 so shabby chic. Um, and what I use to give it a little bit sparkle is this Mod Podge sparkle. And I love the way the finish uh, of this Mod Podge is. It gives it so much shimmer. And so um, I just tore some strips of the paper. And so appropriate, the paper that I use, it's the Tea Party um, paper that comes in that stack. And so, so very pretty. And I just took it and tore strips all around the teapot. So stinking cute. And so it is sparkly, um, very... Um, kind of shabby mixed media so to speak and so I took it and I put some rose trim around the top part of it and then I just put a pink um, satin ribbon right here and put one of my center pieces at the um, middle of the bow and I took some flat back pearls and this is the cream color and I just went around the entire um, bottom of the teapot and then on the sides here I took some of the pink flat back pearls and just uh, aligned the handles here and I did it on both sides and so on the top um, I had to add some bling so I have some bling just adhered around the top pot or pot part of the pot and um, as you can see up there at the top right here um, it just kind of comes all the way up to the top um, handle part of the top. So I love, love, love the way this turned out. And what I'm going to do with this little teapot, um, it will go along my um, candy station um, that I am currently in the process of getting set up. Um, so that I can have it all shabby chic. And so I love, love, love it. Love this. And um, I'm probably going to go back to Michael's and pick up a couple of more of these um, little terracotta pot uh, teapots here. Because they are so stinking cute. And I just know it's going to look so um, pretty on my um, table. So I love it. So again and I will have some still photos at the uh, end of the video so you can see all of the texture on um, the teapot and to see how it really really turned out so that is the first thing that I created tonight and then um, the next thing that I created was a card and this is the card that I created now what I use for this card is the CC Design Potty Lucy. And um, I've had this stamp for a while. I ordered it actually from Jamie, not too shabby shop, a little while ago. And um, I thought she was so, so, so stinking cute. And so um, I wanted to create a card with, with um, her. And so I just colored her up with my Copics. Um, I paper pieced a little pot here. And then I added some trim down here at the bottom. And I got that from um, Shondi Walsh um, doing a um, rack that she sent me. And this is how it looks. So cute. And I thought it went really, really well um, with the paper. And, and I'm sorry, with the stamp. So, 
and it's just a, a flower trim here and it is so gorgeous so I thought that was really really pretty so thank you thank you Shonda and I would like to um, show the spell binders that I use for um, this card and I am really really loving this radiant rectangle um, set here so all of the filigrees is just so so pretty so I did use that and last but not least I use some of this gorgeous gorgeous burlap here it's pink and actually I picked this up today while uh, me and Miss Betty Scrap Passion 01 were out antique hauling today and we had so much fun and so um, I just put that on the back of the card here and um, this paper line that's right here is from the Preppy Princess stack and um, I colored it up on Copic paper here and um, just put that um, burlap up under it. And this is the Michaels um, Recollection um, Corrugated Board. And so on the inside of the card, I left it plain to go back later and add a sentiment on there. But if you can see here, I took it and used that pattern paper and I um, used my um, crinkler and I, I made it a corrugated um, sheet of paper there. So I wanted it to coordinate with the coordinate, um, corrugated um, card set here. So um, I love the way uh, Miss Potted Lucy came out and so... Thanks, guys, so much for watching. Um, please leave a comment. And um, if you haven't checked out the um, line at Michael's with the potted um, um, teapots there, please go over and check them out because they have some awesome, awesome um, new arrivals there. So thanks, guys, so much for watching. Please leave a comment and let me know what you think about my projects. And if you are not subscribed, please feel free to subscribe. Thank you and so glad you decided to stop by. Bye.